you can see in my graphics it says front camera visibility limited just as you can see our fsd is taking us from my home location to the nearest macy's and i just activated it through the voice command in tesla and we are using the latest and greatest for fsd hardware 3 12.6.4 and also i'm using the latest version that is 2025 14.9 yes i received that two three days ago i didn't able to get a chance to make a video so we are making a video right now our car is making this unprotected left turn without any hesitation as you can see it make that left turn perfectly without any problem guys also if you're not familiar with me my name is ananto mohammed and i love to film tesla full self-driving videos in New York. We need to change the lane and move to the middle lane because we're going to go straight and the car realized it and now it is changing the lane. Very good job over there. So yeah guys, um, very good job. Uh, this will be a 8 minutes drive. We're going to see how this robo taxi is taking me from my home to that Macy's near my home. So we're gonna find out and it is kind of like dark here because it is 8 30 almost 8 26 uh in new york and definitely if you are riding in a taxi it should able to take you at night time and this is what i'm trying right now especially in dark scenarios like this so that uh, we can observe how tesla fsd or robo taxi take us from point a to point b as you can see the car is not having any hard time and we are looking exactly straight i'm not touching the steering wheel i'm not touching the uh, brake paddle or um, uh, acceleration but the car is taking us from point a to point b and this is what we are observing in this video and this is the latest version we just got it like two three days ago 2025.14.9 most of pe the people are using the 2025 14.7 uh, but i'm fortunate to have this software so we are testing that so let's find out how fsd does over here so as you can see our car stopped for the first time at the stop sign it hesitated a tiny bit takes a little bit more time compared to my taste but not a critical something that we need to you know like uh, uh take care of but the car is doing everything perfectly it is just cleaning the windshield a little bit for some reason it is kind of cloudy a little bit too but the car is definitely you know like uh, cleaning the windshield a little bit and uh, it is very very cloudy it is nighttime almost and uh, we are going to Macy's we are six minutes away from our destination and our car is doing everything perfectly unfortunately I'm not using the outside camera because it's very dark and gloomy and my uh, glass top glass is not that clean that's why I prefer to not use the outside camera but hopefully you can able to see everything through these interior and my camera right guys with the graphics and uh, uh air stuff like that so we're going guys it seems very very good like uh, the car is taking us without any problem it didn't tell me to touch the steering wheel it didn't tell me to look straight in the road or something like that so it is june and as tesla said they're gonna release the robo taxi in texas in 12th june so i'm waiting like you guys we're making a right turn right over here so six minutes away the car is doing everything perfectly without any hesitation and don't forget we are not using the latest hardware fsd or tesla car we are using the hardware 3 which is not hardware 4 and hardware 4 is much better than hardware 3 but still hardware 3 is able and capable of taking me from point a to point b as you can see my hands are right over here and i'm not touching anything in this drive so we're going we're moving the car is doing everything perfectly guys i'm so happy about it that we don't have to do anything at all and then our like the graphics is saying front camera visibility limited because you see that issues like the windshield wiper i saw a tweet today 
uh, from Chuck Cook, if you're uh, familiar with that channel, he told and uh, tweeted on X that, hey, can we fix this issue where this is like completely dry, but my windshield is just keep running and it's just uh, scratch the camera area because of those dust and something like that you know like a little water or something so it makes things blurry for the camera right and which is very bad for a self-driving car as you can see in my graphics it says front camera visibility limited because i can see clearly that there are some marks over my camera area the glass area because the wiper uh, around like two three times just to clear something I really don't know and that's where that glass gets blurred and the camera can't see probably properly which is a bad thing because it is just unnecessary to wipe right so that's why this graphics comes up this uh, error comes up that front camera vis visibility is yeah, limited but you know like probably they're gonna one day fix these issues too we're gonna make a left turn after this car our car should proceed and our car is proceeding without any problem and the car make the, this left turn without any problem at all so now we're gonna play a game with you guys my viewers because you guys love to play this game with me so the game rules is I'm gonna tell you a number right now and if you watch the video till now you know the number so in today's episode the number will be eight so just write down eight in the comment section or whatever you prefer any suggestion any kind of you know like idea you have in your mind that I can make a video about it so please write down that uh, in the comment section or about any video quality issues or anything you want to see um, just let me know in the comment section so we're just two minutes away and as you can see our car is taking us uh, to that area so it was a little hesitant to get into this road but it is another driveway to get into the um, uh, Wagman, I guess, Wagman store. But we do, we're not going to go over there. We're just going to make a lane change right over here, what the car did right now. And we should just go and march from here. You don't need to stop, there, but the robo taxi prefers to do that. You can just easily march from here. You don't need to stop. This is not a stop sign. This is not a yell sign or something like that. It can just easily go in one time. But the, the car, the robo taxi you know is very cautious and i really respect that we need to change one more lane and we're going to change one more lane and move to the left side or the middle lane and then we're going to make a left turn from there so the car should get in right now yes a little slight delay or like late decision over there it could just easily go and pass that and make that left turn but the car prefers to stop here being very cautious i definitely respect that and i can't do anything because it's a robo taxi i'm just sitting here putting my seat belts on for safety and just observing how the car is driving as you can see i didn't have to touch anything and the car is taking me from point A to point B. Also, the navigation is a big issue in this platform right now. Why I'm telling it? Because as a human, I know if we didn't make that right turn, we could just easily go straight and get into that Macy because that's right over there. But the car choose a longer route just because of the navigation. Because Google map, uh, where Tesla gets the data, like Google map is, telling us to go from here it is taking another entra entrance from for the mall right it has another entrance exactly where we make that right turn it didn't need to make that right turn because easily go straight and get into that mall and get into that in front of the Macy's and we didn't have to do any turns at all right but just because of the navigation issues we had to face this kind of uh, problem so let me know in the comment if you ever felt that way so we are in front of macy's guys i'm telling you the truth we are in front of macy's right now and it's gonna probably park in front of the entrance it is trying to go and uh, you shouldn't just make this left turn you could just drop me off there but it is trying to park and which is it which is a good thing to do but i know harder three can do a perfect parking uh when it tries to do that so you see it just parked very weirdly but i'm gonna end the video here because we risked over here now is 
FSD is turn, what is gonna do, you know? It's just gonna go stuck over here. I'm just gonna get out from this car because it's a robo taxi, guys. Have a wonderful day and thank you so much. Have a good day. As you can see in my graphics, it says front camera visibility limited. Just as you can see, our FSD is taking us from my home location to the nearest Macy's.